Have you ever seen one of those cool looking countdown timers inside of an email and wondered how can you create one for your own emails? In this video, you'll learn how to set one up in no time. Let's go. All right, guys, so I moved over to my computer screen so I can walk you through step by step on how to set up your very first countdown timer. I personally use this software that's called centric.com. Pretty easy to use, works great with Klaviyo and it's cost effective. Make sure to get yourself an account so you can follow along with this tutorial. Once you have an account, you wanna to go to this timers tab and click on create new. Now we use two types of countdown timers. The first one is standard, which is great for campaigns and perpetual, which is great for flow emails. And I'll walk you through on why. Let's say you wanna have a countdown timer for your abandoned checkout discount reminder, right? Let's say 24 hours left to redeem your discount, right? So something that looks like this. You see, as soon as I open the email, the countdown timer starts ticking down, okay? So this is how we created this one. For example, for this flow emails for the abandoned checkout reminder. I basically put one day here. I name it something like AC, so abandoned checkout, 24 hours. Okay, and I hit create and voila. This is all set and ready to be implemented inside of the Klaviyo email template. Okay, so this is example number one. And for this example here, I'd like to create a countdown timer for a campaign that I'm gonna walk you through on how to create this right now. So I'm gonna create a Cyber Monday countdown timer. Okay, so Cyber Monday 2023. And I wanna base it off of New York's time zone. Cyber Monday this year is on the 27th at midnight. Okay, so just set up the timing right here. And it's gonna be easier right here actually. So midnight and I'm gonna hit on create. Okay, make sure it's on standard and let's hit create and voila. You see, this is the, the timer that counts down exactly to uh, Cyber Monday at midnight. So Monday at midnight and it's all ready to use. You can pretty much optimize it. You can adapt it to user time zone. You can change the sizes right here. Optimize it to your store's colors and even fonts right here. You can play with different fonts. I usually like to go with medium. I think it's a good size and depends on the brand and their colors and their fonts. I usually play around with that. You can even add an image to be in the background. So super easy. Took us literally a few seconds. And now let's see how we can implement this inside of Klaviyo. So I'm gonna go into a template here. This one, for example, you can see Cyber Monday um, sale, okay? And I wanna add a countdown timer. So first, we wanna go into the block section and drag a text block, okay? In here, you wanna go into source code, delete everything from here, and paste the code that we just copied from Centric. Click on done, and voila. You have a standard countdown timer that is set for 12, AM for midnight on Monday, okay? Super easy, super straightforward. And now the next step that you wanna make sure that you have is any customization. So if you want, need to go back and customize this further, you will do this directly in here, right? You don't need to touch anything in Klaviyo and you should be all set. If you found this video helpful, it's part of our comprehensive email and SMS marketing masterclass. It's 100% free and available to watch right here on YouTube. If you'd like to learn how to scale your e-commerce store with email and SMS marketing, I'll put a link down in the description box. Go ahead and check it out right away. And please give this video a like so the algorithm knows Nate is doing some good videos over there. And subscribe to my channel for more Klaviyo tips and tutorials. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video.